to another video and today i'm gonna be showing you how to animate all right so step one of course we're gonna need our rig so i'll just use this uh i'll just start uh with a basic animation for walking so of course when you walk uh what i usually do to make the rig look better is i would usually slant it over a bit instead of like completely straight because then it would i don't know it's just a little easier to make it look better while it's a little slanted like this so usually when i start animating like this i want to get the first keyframe that's gonna loop so when i do a walking animation i usually have uh it would usually have well i usually do like a few um steps so you see how the leg is going up so we're gonna slightly move this because this is basically in between while the uh while the character is walking and taking a step so this is about to take a step and then we'll go like uh 15 milliseconds in and then we'll make it take the step now what i like to do is make it go a little bit more down and also do this so it looks like um the character is bumping while walking because you know when you walk you go up and down so of course you want to do that i'm just getting everything set up i'm not going to add any tweening yet so i'm just going to make sure this looks good and then i'll teach you the next part looks fine to me um now what i usually do is to keep it consistent i'm not gonna remake the whole stepping up animation i'm just gonna do this and then try to make it look like i so i just switch the limbs on which one's going up and down so now we have this one going up we have the right leg going up so now we have the right leg of course i slightly move the arms there same here and now that we have this once again we just take this and go about 15 milliseconds further and then add the animation where your character takes the step so once i finish doing this part i'll show you how it looks all right so now we have our next step and if we loop it i'll just make it 61 fps so as you can see it doesn't really look the smoothest and also it isn't looped properly so to fix this i usually just go like five to ten milliseconds later and then i put the first keyframe and then we have a perfect walking animation loop so now that we have this we can add some tweening to make it look better if you know how uh do linear animation i don't know why you're even clicking on this video because you know you should probably uh anyway so since moon animator 2 is a little weird they make it so you have to select the first you have to select the keyframes before the thing you want to tween so I'll just do quad and out. So now, when they take a step, this is going to tween. And also what I noticed is that the leg movement right here is a little weird. I'm just going to make it more like that. Anyway, so so you basically just tween anything that's um, that's actually stepping down. So when they lift the leg, you want to make sure you don't tween that. And then when they put their foot down again, you don't want to tween that. I mean, you want to tween that and then just leave it like that. And now, um, there we go. It's a walking animation. animation. I'll show you guys how to do uh, idle animation now. All right, so once again, we go into a uh, new animation. We call it idle. We select our rig. And this time, 
what I usually like to do. You can make this however you want, but how what I like to do is like average so the characters look a little bit slanted a bit and then they look forward. And then you just make the legs look okay, I guess. So I'll tell you I'll show you when I I'll show you when I get the pose. Okay, so of course this isn't gonna be good. I'm kind of rushing these right now, so bear with me. Okay, so what I usually do since I got my first pose down. I'm not the best at idle animations in my opinion. I, I'm not really that good at them. But, alright, so the first thing you want to do is you want to go about like... It depends how fast you want the breathing in and breathing out to be. What I usually do is just do like one minute or not a minute uh, a second sorry so I go one second in and I make the pulse where they breathe in of course so let me just do that real quick all right so while they're breathing in they move back a little bit of course to make it better I'm just gonna use cleaning so it's easier. Once again, my animation isn't going to be perfect. I'm not really putting in that much effort. So now we just copy the keyframe right here. Where they breathe. And a lot of times I want to put like a 20 to 30 millisecond gap. Where it just stay breathed in. And then once again, we just go since we did 130. We go to like 1030. There. And now we can just loop the animation. And that's your idle animation, I guess. I mean, I personally wouldn't use this in a game. But of course, you can actually spend time to make yours look better. That's how you can do basic animations. Hope you all enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys all later, and goodbye. Also, like and subscribe if, you know, the video was actually helpful or something. I, I get a lot of people going like, the video doesn't work! Um, I'm not really sure how that doesn't work if I did in the video, but yeah. Anyways, I'll see you guys all later, and goodbye.